It's Tuesday morning. The County Board of Supervisors will be discussing deaths in our county jails. This all comes as the Sheriff's Department unveils new policies aimed at keeping inmates safer. CBS 8's Dana Marie McNichol live outside the County Administration Building to explain. Good morning, Dana Marie. Good morning. Well, this all comes after a report released some sta staggering statistics, finding that over the past 15 years, San Diego County jails have seen more inmate deaths than most in the state of California. And that's why this morning the County Board of Supervisors and the Sheriff's Department are talking about these policy changes. So I'm going to break down what the state auditors found in this report. They found that the department's failure to consistently provide adequately medical and mental health Health care likely contributed to its high number of in custody deaths. Now that's when something called the Citizens Law Enforcement Review Board, known as CLRB, steps in. Now, this is a special board in San Diego independently and impartially investigating citizen complaints about San Diego County Sheriff's deputies and probation officers. Now, the state auditor found that this board has been insufficient. But now announcements are being made on how this is going to change. Now, interim sheriff Kelly Martinez says the policy changes include more timely and proper safety checks, medication assisted treatment for inmates and more deputies wearing body cameras inside the jails. The sheriff's department says it's currently understaffed, but is making an effort to hire more deputies to implement this new policy. Now, we spoke to prison rights advocate Mary Estrada, who says She's encouraged by these changes. I think it's awesome because, I mean, we need to know what goes on in there. You know, they're hired and they've, you know, taken the oath to protect, you know, the inside. And um, if they're not doing that, you know, again, they need to be held accountable. The word is accountable. That's what she's really honing in on transparency and how these new policies can really help give more trust to the public in terms of law enforcement, but also some relief and understanding from those family members who have had inmates pass away in the jails. Now, we were, I, we just spoke with um, San Diego for Justice. They were also had a report and review on how these changes can be implemented, and they said that Clara would like to expand its jurisdiction, not only being able to ask questions to deputies, but also medical staff in making those investigations. So this morning, the County Board of Supervisor will be discussing how these policies can move forward. I'm Dana Marie McNichol, live at the County Administration Building.